I've got one of these. Rather big hose. Mm. And it's in a sleeping bag. <laughs> More about that very, very soon. Anyway, pour yourself a nice glass of Merlot. Got right into red wine lately. It's good for you as well, as long as you don't drink three bottles. And roll the video. Well, here's my big hose on my Henry Hoover pneumatic. My trusty machine. So it's ribbed. Yes, my hose is ribbed. Can you believe it? And it's long. You never thought you'd hear that in one sentence, would you? But it's also damaging to my car. So start off with a clean car. Make sure your car is clean, top tip, because this will cause so much damage. So what are we gonna do about it? Well, some crazy bloke has invented something called the VAC wrap. Crazy, I wish I'd had this idea. Here it is, it's a protective hose sleeve. What a brilliant idea. No, it's not an electric blanket. So it's quite simple. Lay it on the floor. Doesn't matter which end you do, it's got to zip one end obviously. You're gonna open it up. These are available in different sizes as well. So if your hose is bigger than mine, I bet it isn't, then state it when you order it. And all we do is place it underneath and zip it up. How simple is that? Now when you get to either end, you get to tie it up in a really simple way like this. Sorry, I only learned to do my shoelaces last week. I'm not very quick. Now you have these laces both ends. What I will say to you guys is when you come to do the other end, where your attachments go, just give yourself plenty of room. I actually moved it back because I found it was encroaching on the tool. When I went to switch the tools, it just got in the way. So move it back, get it set up properly. And there it is, with the zip facing up. Even though it's closed, it's good practice just to keep it upright. Ah, oh, here he is. Now, of course, you can lift it up. I know, I'm just demonstrating what could happen. I'm not gonna scratch my bumper again. That's where you're gonna cause all the marring. It actually looks like lines. Maybe if you've ever come across this, if you've had a dirty bumper and you, you've done this, you've accidentally caught the bumper, it just looks like lines and it just creates scratches on the clear coat. So that's the boot. What the? Get off. I don't know who that bloke is. Don't get your parcel shelf. If you're a dog owner, you're gonna want more than the uh, vacuum cleaner for this. That's where all the hairs go. It's not just the bumper you have to worry about, it's the interior as well. This is where it comes into its own. And that is it, that is the two part video this week. Quick one, eh? All the links for this will be underneath the video. If you wanna go and purchase one of these, state your length and uh, click buy now. Right, when it comes onto the uh, the sleeping bag for your ribbed hose, <laughs> it, this is just amazing. I'm, I've got, I'm really blown away by this because it's such a simple idea and how someone didn't think of it years ago, I don't know. I have scratched my bumper in the past. Now, as mentioned in the video, you've got to make sure your car is clean on the outside to minimise risk in the first place. But the rib section of these, I mean, there's a... There's only two things in life that should be ribbed. No, there's one other thing that should be ribbed and it's, it's not this. I think you know what that is. Anyway, but this is such a clever idea. You know, it's just soft to the touch. It's well made, well thought out. Like it comes in different sizes. I mean, there you go. Holding my hose off, off camera. Don't wanna do that. <coughs> it's just a great idea. It's brilliant. Uh, so that's the VAC wrap. I put all the details underneath this video. Pretty short video this week. We will be back with Obviously, lots more videos. As we speak, I'm waiting for a DHL driver to turn up with a rather special uh, delivery. More about that on Instagram, no doubt, in the weeks to come. So make sure you subscribe. 
keep putting your thumbs up. I haven't said that for a while. The interactivity of this channel is brilliant. We've got so many brilliant guys and girls down below which interact with the channel. I'll try and get back to as many people as possible. We've just gone past 18,000, which is just amazing. It's, it's crazy. And uh, long may it continue, because I'm not going anywhere. Well, I am. It's really cold in here. I'm going indoors in a minute, but <sighs> stop rabbiting. Anyway, take care, guys. Thanks for watching. See you again in the next one.